young, old, middle-aged, man, woman, whatever. It, it's pretty simple to get involved in hunting. There's a lot of public ground that you can seek out and go hunting. The first thing you want to do is go to a local bow shop or a local gun shop. A lot of people want to go to the big box stores and, you know, buy them a bow, buy them a gun. They get the gun off the shelf or the bow off the shelf. They hit a pie plate at 10 yards. They're going hunting. Not the thing to do. Okay. You, you can go get you a gun or a bow, but practice before you go out. have the, the quickest, the most ethical kill that we can give them. Um, they're giving their life for us, for one, entertainment, and two, to survive. But you go, you get your gun, you get your bow, whatever it wants to be. There's a ton of different brands that is out there. One for instance, one brand that has fit us tremendously, and we love the, the bow, we love how it feels, the kinetic energy, the speed, the way it's built, and all that, and, I mean, Scorpid crossbows. Um, we will be shooting them for the rest of our lives or until they stop making them, which I don't think that'll happen. But you find a bow or a gun that fits you. You take it out, you practice it. You get with somebody that has hunted. Um, whether you seek them out on Facebook, whether you, you know, go to your local sports show, try to find somebody, find a family member that friend. has hunted. Friend. Find a friend. Um, get with somebody who has done it. Hopefully, they will take you to their spot to show you. You know what? They don't have to let you hunt. You know, just have them take you so you can sit back and observe. You know, hopefully they will, you know, let you hunt. We are starting something that we're going to pick five kids a year. Um, and I say kids, you know what? If an adult comes, it's never hunted and he doesn't have the resources. We're going to introduce them into the outdoors. But go to your local bow shop. Go to your local gun shop. Talk to the owners. They will know people that's in the hunting industry. You get your weapon. That's your main main thing, your weapon. I see a lot of people that, oh, I don't want to spend $1,000 on a bow or a gun. Well, spend the money on a good weapon because that there is your, your key, your center. That, that's your main piece of equipment for hunting you know yeah your camouflage has to be good and all that but your camouflage can be the best but if you don't have the a good enough gun bow optics any of that doesn't matter how good that camo is you're not going to hit your target that's my advice on getting into the hunting there i was back in the wild again Right at home, where I belong. I have that feeling coming over me again. Just like it happened so many times before. Hey, Maddie! 